also getting you the latest uh, from Manipur. Now, this is a state which the BJP has been able to sway in its favor. And today is uh, when they have to prove their majority on the floor of the House. BJP already moving first uh, and ending the 139 days of Naga economic block and a big boost to the party ahead of the floor test. So, this is what uh, BJP needs for majority 31 seats. It says that it has support of the allies, taking the total to 33 seats as well. So, BJP's road to power looks set if there could be any last moment surprises or not because there is the the congress rebel mla which can play a spoil sport talking more about that with my colleague first up reaction coming in hum abhi tor four ka kaam mein hamara interest nahi hai hamara 33 hai congress ka 27 hai wohi result aayega trust vote mein hamara jo hai abhi hum political activities se governance tak hum log shift ho gaya hai we have shifted the gear all right, let me go across to my colleague Manogya who will break it down for us. So Manogya, is uh, the BJP in a comfortable seat today or there could be a last minute surprise that it is jittery off? Devina, even if there are surprises, they would be in favor of BJP. What you heard, Hemant of Bisu Sarma clearly stating that they are no more in the Thor 4 business. Well, they have done that quite enough and they must be tired of doing it and that's the reason why they've shifted focus to governance. What they would deliver today it would be interesting to watch. The, all the people, the MLAs, are already in the assembly. 60 MLAs, including Ibobi Singh, who said that he had agreed that he would sit in the opposition. But would N. Biren Singh be able to manage the chief ministerial post with the vote of confidence today also? And the floor test. We've been told that they have 32 MLAs already in their support, including Biren Singh. And of course, the TMC MLAs with the party and has finally joined this brigade too. But interestingly, there is one of those Congress disgruntled MLAs too who has parted ways from Congress. So that comes as an advantage for BJP. Even if he abstains from voting, he would give an added number to BJP. Interesting time to watch on how it goes ahead because this would be the first BJP ever government made in the state of Manipur, which has been a strong Congress bastion three terms of Ibobi Singh and even this time we, despite winning 28 seats in the results he has not been able to manage the government formation and that's what is that makes Manipur so interesting and that's what makes the northeast so interesting with the focus of the central government shifting to northeast and this of course one of those biggest moves and biggest achievements for the party. All right uh, thanks so much uh, Manogya for joining us with all the details uh, getting some breaking news at this point of time.